He's just <laughs> happy guy. He's happy to be there. He just wants to hang out with the guys. He wants to drink beers. He's like old school throwback guy. Uh, pulls up with a groin pole every summer camp in Chicago. Somehow randomly would get injured every camp. So he wouldn't have to do the workouts. But uh, one of those guys who can kind of get away with anything he wanted because he's so good. This is when he's 17 years old. They call him up. Say, hey, Buff, we drafted you. We'd like you to come to our... our uh, Rookie, rookie, rookie camp, yeah. It's in three weeks. This guy's going to be getting a hold of you, blah, blah, blah. Okay. And hangs up the phone. As soon as he hangs up the phone, he unplugs all the phones in his house and basically disappears. He doesn't want to go to the rookie rookie thing. <laughs> He's like, wait, it's in a week? So they had to put out like a nationwide search just to get a hold of him. They couldn't get a hold of him just because he didn't want to go for some summer camp. He wanted to enjoy his summer. I mean, what other player can be a defenseman in the minor leagues and then go up to Chicago, play as a forward, win the Stanley Cup, and then put back on D. Get the fuck out of here, Pinky! That's what. Fucking funniest guys ever. You ever see him give the ref a high five during the game? <laughs> in the midst of the play? Oh, fucking, the ref puts his hand up for last change. Or fucking, he's got a guy right, pinned in the baby. corner, uh. you know, looking at everybody in the first row. He said he took a year off when he was 14 or 15, and I asked him why. He's like, I just wanted to go hunting more. He is the biggest freak of an athlete I've ever seen. He again plays a back-to-back in Chicago Friday, Saturday, and then he leaves Nashville Saturday night to play five games in five nights with us in Hershey. This is like, I've never seen anyone play five games in five nights, oh. and he was getting breakaways. He was literally getting breakaways shorthanded. Like, he was still leading the rush. And guys were asking him, just getting an old, you know, like, what do you, do you, do you know, have you heard of Joe Sackick? And he's like, I, who's that guy, you know? I never heard of Brandon Shanahan. Never heard of him. Never knew anything. Never, well, I don't watch hockey, you know? Like. He's one of three guys I just stopped trying to hit I because know. you'd go to hit him and he'd put you flat on your back and like, then he'd look around for like what hit him. Or what bumped him, and you'd be like, I know. I thought you didn't even see me, and I was going to crush you, and down I went. And I think I got him 